Go Cubs. Part three, follow up. Only one real baseball team in Chicago. And that's the Cubs. That's why Sox fans hate us so much. Because we the best. Had to go get Cubs tattoo. That's die hard. Cubs 24 karat plated. See somebody gotta do some dishes over there. Baseball. Hawkins, Fuentes, and now Corpus. Jorge Bullio, the man that's high definition. I can't watch TV without watching high definition TV. Rally visor. Get up on it. Rockies pitching. And the 10 strikeouts in the contest. Round again to 2-2. In the air to right center field. Over is Sullivan. And the Rockies take game one of the series. The Rockies take game one. Colorado comes in and gets their second postseason win in franchise history. First one back in 95 at Atlanta. They come in to Philadelphia and take game one of the series. Fantastic job by the Rockies pitching staff to hold this offense down, and they just stole one on the road against the ace of the Phillies staff. Billy Cork is able to finish it off. Well, now certainly the pressure shifts to the Phillies tomorrow, and how important is tomorrow for the Phillies in the short series? And they're running a rookie out there, Kyle Kendrick, a guy that they relied on heavily in the second half of the season. Sinker slash guy, and he's got to be sharp with his control. Ahead of the count, good ground ball guys, but Kyle Kendrick, he's got to get the job done. Sometimes it depends how you're going at the end of the season. If that Colonel squad has won 50 in the last 16 games, we're going to have well, a very impressive outing today for Jeff Francis. Anybody else you want to send it down to David Aldridge. David? Well, I must tell you, Jeff Francis, you said you weren't going to be nervous or you're going to try to take care of that heartbreak. You look pretty cool out there at your first postseason start. Well, I don't think I said I wasn't going to be nervous. I said I was going to try and this handle is my it view. as well as I could. This my view. I watch TV every day. Well, there's, there's no question. There's a lot of energy. And, you know, you try and find ways to slow yourself down a little bit. What was the game plan that you and Bob Apodaca came up with to shut down Philadelphia's top four? They're 0 for 12 with a bunch of strikeouts. Uh, I don't know, really just execute the pitches I wanted to do, you know. I, things I do, just, you know, going with fastballs down away and mixing up speeds. And, um, you know, that's what I've done all year, and you just try to execute those things today. Obviously, the shadows played a part in this game. How did you use that to your advantage? Uh, there's no way I can use it. They're just there. There's no way you can change them, but uh, unfortunately, we, it didn't affect us as much as that, maybe. Congratulations. You got the win on the road. Keep that hot streak going. All right.